Welcome y'all to Spacey Tracy Nails. Today is the Saturday Stampin' Club and the theme is stars. And I'm doing a little something kind of outside the box. Not exactly um, stars you probably think of uh, being um, space, um, 4th of July, that type of thing. This isn't um, what I was doing. I'm doing something kind of outside the box. So if you didn't want to do anything for like that, but this is just um, a, a, just a simple one. And uh, what I have on my nails. Oh, first off, please go check out the other ladies. Uh, their information is down below in the description box. And I do appreciate all of you coming and checking out our channels, watching our channels. If you are from any of the other ladies, I appreciate that you're coming and giving me a chance to see what I do. Uh, and uh, also, um, I'm just trying to grow my channel. And once I get to a thousand, I'm going to do a giveaway. All right. Uh, we'll just kind of get to this <laughs> completely, but um, I did have the ladies uh, pictures at the beginning and uh, all their information, like I said, is down below in the description box. And I'm telling you, they are good. So I have a lot to live up to. <laughs> so I am still, you know, only been doing this for a couple of years. It just takes time to get better at it. And I am really challenging myself now. So if you like to see people do that, uh, I am not a, uh, you know, tech or anything like that. Uh, I just do this because um, it makes me happy, okay? And uh, I like being a part of the nail community. It gives me somewhere to have, uh, you know, like be a part of a family with that too. And uh, they are just great. They always help you if there's something that you need, uh, so just ask. But anyway, I am going to quit blabbing and let's get started. We got some Orly, uh, which is on my three nails, and it is um, glass half full. These would have been from TJ Maxx or uh, Marshalls. I, I couldn't tell you when. I get them, but that's where I get my things like that. And the same with this uh, color club. And this one is called um, Till the Record Stop Stops. And uh, it's just a cream. It's what I have here and here. So I know that looks kind of weird. It's lighter than that, but it's actually once you put on a few coats, it's this color. So. All right, now. Um, what we need to do is, I'm doing some stamping, because that's what we are, the Saturday Stamping Club, and I'm going to be using a Maniology plate, and it's M53, and uh, first off, to use this plate, I need to take off the film, because that's very, very important. Can't get anywhere without that film taken off. So we're going to take that off first, and... I'm doing these. Um, I have been doing them on press sounds, uh, but they're usually on the um, magnetic uh, little uh, holders. I am doing it where they're on my nail this time. I'm just going to try that as well. It's just because I need to get better at that too. I need to get better at both. Uh, let me just kind of get you guys in here just a second. There we go. Forgot to do that. Okay. Anyway, uh, we have uh, the film taken off, and then I'm going to take a lint-free little pad. Uh, I got mine from Amazon, and I want to clean my plate with a hundred percent acetone, not with anything that has like a um, additive in it. Boy, I can't get this stuff. It's hard to do with these nails. Okay. Got too used to doing nails on the things instead of doing them on my nails. Now I can't hardly do anything with them. All right. All right. We need to um, get where I need to go here. Once I find my awesome claw, need that. 
And then the color I'm going to be using, which I have a code for, Maniology, which is Stacy Tracy 10. And all my discount codes and everything are down below. And then we have a clear jelly stamper one, and this is um, 029. And um, I have a code for them, and it's Spacey Tracy Nails. Um, but again, everything is down below in the description box. All right, now, I was thinking this pink would be really cool. It's right outside the box, it has nothing to do with um, any holidays or anything like that. I am just going to use a, let's see, what kind of am I going to use to the stamper this time? I think I'm going to use my clear jelly stamper. And to do that, we need to clean off the um, stamper first. Always clean it off because there might be some junkies on there and uh, it's a good idea to do that so that you kind of, you know, like start on a clean escape slate as you can where you've got all the problem and things that could possibly come up. Sorry for this wonderful noise just now. Ah, okay. I take lamp roller, I clean off my wonderful stamper, making sure it's all ready to go. And it is ready to go. And now I can't open this. Shoot. Can't open this. Okay. I am just going to use a um, kind of a generic. It, well, it, it's actually a uh, messy mansion, but they're, I don't think they're around anymore um, for my scraper. Okay, I am back. We are now got our plate, my alley mat that I put underneath to scrape when I scrape. And let's get a, oh, I should have got settled before, huh? Before opening all these things around. I'm just going to take acetone Put it over here so I have something to wipe on. So that's so I can keep my uh, thing clean. Keep the uh, nice um, edges of my stamper or my scraper clean. Uh, and then I just clean it too real quick before making sure it's nice and clean. So basically, I shouldn't have, I should have did this before I started, but I thought maybe you guys would want to see, but I just basically make sure that anything that, that typically is a problem um, with stamping, I try to go through it and see if there's anything that I need to <coughs> fix or do before I start the stamping, try to find all the you know problems that could be an issue at the moment. Alrighty. We are going to do something pretty simple. So again, like I said, it's, um, it is stars and, uh, that's what the thing is, stars. And I am going to pick a couple of them here that would be a good star. I know, um, These are kind of cool. All right, but I'm not doing them as a French manicure, just so you know. Uh, I know that's kind of what you probably thought I was gonna do, right? Nope, 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 I'm gonna do a twist on you again. I am going to um, just put these like uh, as a band, basically, um, on my nails. And I wanna do it where, like there's a couple here, um, just, on the nails as a band, not necessarily the French manicures that they are. And it, that's the one thing about French manicures, you can use them for other things. You know, use them uh, just like as an abstracting in my opinion. Uh, and I want to make sure this is all nice and, nice and clean or mixed up as best as I can. And you want to start with something that's not. All right. Let's just 
pop in here and get the going. Uh, so I'm not really going to use these because that kind of does scream 4th of July to me. Um, or these, I think they kind of did too. So these are the ones that, that one has a star on them. That one has a star and that one has a star. I don't know if the other ones really have a star. That one does too, but kind of reminds me of the thing too, but so I think I'm going to do these three. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. All right, we'll just get started and see where we go. Also, I do have it where there is um, a top coat on here, a gel top coat, so that if I mess up or anything, I'm able to uh, start over, which has become a very, very cool thing for me now. I think that that's the only thing I ever do with my gels. I mean, that would be worth it in it right there. All right, so we need to do, okay. I'm trying to clean up all that. At least I have a problem getting them off there. Okay, so what we wanna do, I think just like, hmm. Trying to make it even. I don't know if you can see that. So I'm pushing down, pushing down. There we go. Well, and again, I don't like how that is like in the middle there. I always have to do one. One has to come off, no matter what. No matter what I do, one of my first stamps, the first one typically has to come off, but I don't like that um, right there uh, if I needed it to be a little bit more centered. And that's what bothered me with that one. So I'll clean the plate really good. And I'm trying to see because it's not going to fit my whole nail on how I'm in. Oh, that one has a star in it too, so I might use that one too. All right, I think I'm gonna use, okay, that's what I'm gonna do. All right. Sometimes I have the idea in my head and sometimes I just start, um, you know, working with it as I go and start coming up with ideas or change my mind completely or my idea doesn't work out. All right, we're gonna try it again, guys. Really, really gonna try it again. I promise, it's gonna work. I am gonna get these on there sometime today. Okay. All right, there we go. Okay. I'm just trying to even it in there. So there's the first one. That's what it, yeah, it's, so it's not gonna go all the way to the sides. And like I said, this is not going to be a um, French manicure. I know it looks like it, but it's not. Okay, so cleaned all that off. Off we go to the races again, okay. I did that one, and I think I like that one, and that has a star, so that's the main thing, is the theme is stars, so I am doing every star I can, and they have stars, so it's kind of a strange one I'm doing here. Thinking outside the box. I really like that when I think outside the box. I'm gonna turn it this way. So I'm trying to get it where it's like right in the middle. I don't know about you guys, do you ever hate that? It's like, if it's gonna be off kiltered, it has to be off kiltered the same as much as possible. You know, that's my 
nothing about it. All right, now we got that one. Okay, so I need to put one over here. I did this, uh, let's see, what did I do? I did that one and I did that one. I should have not like, you know, done anything if I would have kept them. Uh, we're gonna do that one right up there. Yep, I do that one. Okay. Here we go. And there we go. So these are basically um, French manicure, uh, I'm sure. To be used for French manicures, but that's not what I am doing. Get gracious, I can't get it up there. Get off of there. Okay, let's do it over here. Trying to figure out am I in the middle? Am I in the middle? Do I think I'm in the middle? Okay. Um, yeah. Okay. All right, so now I put them in the middle, like I was kind of looking for, and um, yeah, I like that. You can see it. Mm-hmm. All right, now, should I put them on all of them? I think I should. Don't you? I think I should. Let's just star these things up. Okay, yeah, I think I will. Now, which one are we gonna do for the thumb and the pinky? So I did that one. I'm trying to think, which ones did I do here? I did that one. And I did this one. So I think we're gonna do that one on the pink uh, on the pinky. Yep, yeah. do that one on the pinky. Okay, there we go. Do that one on the pinky. And I didn't clean my thing, but that's okay. It, it didn't become an issue, but oof. it's not going to become an issue either because, yeah, it's not going to be an issue either because it's on the pinky. All right, so now we just need to do the middle. And this time, Okay. Uh, I see something I did. I'm just going to take a little bit of um, acetone. And I don't know if you saw what I did it, but because I didn't clean it off as much, I clean that off right there. Okay. There we go. All right. Now we go. All right. I'm, I'm liking it. I don't think it's terrible. Okay, now, um, I guess I need to figure out what to do with... I think I'm gonna do that one. Yeah, I just couldn't figure that one out. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna do that one, I think, over here on the thumb. Yep. On the thumb we go. Okay, it's gonna be this one.
There we go. I did it again. Where I just, see. I did it again. Where I made a mess. Right there. It's okay. Again, it's okay. I just, because I have the gel on there, I can just go over it with the acetone. As long as I don't try to take out anything else. Okay. So, there we go. We have some really neat little, um, bars, I guess you could say. They're not French manicures, I just threw them in the middle of each one of them. But that's my stars. I mean, they are stars. Okay, I am back. So now I have decided, like I said, as I go, I typically change my mind on things. I have decided that I needed something with these. They're just a little bleh. But that, that's the stamping. So see. So I don't, it's not that I don't like the stamping. Um, I just think they're kind of blah. So I'm thinking let's throw some butterflies. Cause you can't go wrong with butterflies. All right, butterflies is good. Really good. All right, so let's just kind of throw. A couple of butterflies on here. Doesn't have to be all of them, but yeah, I'm kind of leaning towards okay there we go and maybe one more maybe a little tiny one maybe a little, little, little tiny one that is if I can pick this thing up. Good gracious. They make it so difficult. I don't understand. I try, I try, I try. Okay. My needle plier or uh, tweezers have gotten a little I don't know. Is that good enough? I think so. I think that works. Okay. There they are. That's what I did. I did butterflies with my stamping. I don't know if they all need butterflies. Do they all need butterflies? No, you don't want to do all of them. But anyway, there they are. That's my uh, Saturday stamping collab. Like I said, go check out the other ladies and uh, go see what they have done. And I hope everybody's having a great day. Thank you so much for coming and watching me do my nails. And let me know, do you like decals? Have you ever, I mean, do you like use them to kind of spuce up your mani if it looks a little blah? Um, or, yeah. 
I think they were different, but anyway. Yep. So here we go. There they are. Hope everybody is having a wonderful weekend or um, and it's whether it's day or night and uh, yeah this is Spacey Tracy Nails signing off